Inflation is adding pressure on some Atlanta families when they hit the grocery store. One grassroots organization is bringing fridges full of groceries to towns all over the area. And the communities in those areas are keeping the fridges full. CBS 46's Sawyer Bussy has more. We're at the Refuge Coffee Company truck in Clarkston, Georgia. Clarkston is considered the most diverse square mile in America. It's the heartbeat of this community. Well, by people coming to our coffee shops um, and buying a cup of coffee, they are helping to provide jobs for refugees and immigrants from literally all over the world. Enjoy. Great. Thank you. In the hour and a half we were here, we must have seen two dozen people in line to get coffee or tea. You can take this whole bag with you. Do you like apples? Mm -hmm. Okay, let me get you some apples. Or to stop here. In this location, because there's such a huge population of refugees, which are, you know, a lot of families who are very experienced cooking, they prefer ingredients. They prefer produce. But then at other fridges that cater more to the unhoused population, they prefer grab and go meals. This is a free 99 fridge, a grassroots effort to bring free food to communities. It's so easy. It doesn't cost anything. You don't have to bring food, um, but oftentimes I just come here and clean up. Volunteers keep these fridges clean, stocked, running properly. Um, and we're bringing donations to each of the fridges. So this was my stop and then HodgePodge and North Decatur Church will also have $400-ish worth of groceries put in them today. The fridges go empty at times for a variety of reasons. Yeah. Volunteers tell us inflation and this heat could be causing the demand for free groceries to intensify. So we have feminine products, pet food, baby food. Um, there's really a need for all of it we found, um, especially right now with supply chain shortages and things like that. It's hard to find for a lot of families. Sawyer Bussey, CBS 46 News.